Hey guys, this is George speaking. How are you? Uh, long time no see, guys. I hope uh, you're there, you're safe and everything's okay. Uh, this is George from MG Comics, aka Comic Age. So uh, we've been buying a lot of collections. We've been being busy sending in CGC books and CBCS signing, uh, you know. So a little bit of everything there. Just busy with our lives. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm gonna show you. We bought like a lot of small collections. You know, I didn't really want to make videos. I was just um, busy with st doing stuff. But at least I uh, hope you guys missed me a little bit because I sure missed you guys. Okay, here's a collection we just purchased. All right, here's what it looks like. Nothing really huge, but nevertheless, you know, it's uh, it's okay. I mean, uh, compared to the other collection we bought. So we have most of these books. This book I like a lot. That's, uh, you know, guys, uh, it's a first appearance of a, me a good character there. So that's a, uh, well, it's not first appearance, but it's a good battle. Okay, this is the first Psylocke, the, the, the new Psylocke, whatever, full appearance. Okay, engagement. This is a good one, too. Yeah, I like that one. Uh, first appearance of a, I forgot what it's called, but it's first appearance. Uh, Doomsday. Okay, this is good. This is another one that's pretty good. First appearance. All right, not bad. Okay. All right. These are Venom. You know, not, you know, nothing really big, you know. All right, let's see what else is in here. What beauty. I hope you guys are doing good. This is a good one, too. The shape is so-so, but it's okay. All right, what are we looking at? Some Spider-Mans. You know, it has some, uh, some Maxim Carnage. You know, you could probably make a run of these. So that's pretty good. You know, all right, some Spider Man's, you know, just regular Spider Man's. These are falling off. All right, so some, uh, you know, this is always a good issue. All right, so these are some Batman's, nothing major. Number 600, number 610. I think the key issues he pulled out the customer, uh, the, the, the seller, the, you know, the person that sold me. So, but there's still some decent ones in here, they're not all taken out. Just some of them. 666 is here. So that's a good one there. You know, I'm just pulling out the key books that for me I find are more viable. Uh, so this is pretty good. I mean, there's some Batmans. Batman's always good. Yeah, a lot of um, those, um, whatchamacallit there, the, the Elseworld. And, you know, some of them are really tough to find there. So these are always been a little bit tougher to find, you know, the, another nail. Uh, so this this would sell pretty easily there. This part here, that's an easy set to make. Uh, this one too is like the nail always sells good. That's a good good set. It's a three part issue. Yeah, yeah. easy to to make a set there. You know, okay. Uh, let me see. Uh, yeah, so not bad. These are. Uh, this is always good, right? Secret identity. That's always a good set. They're a little bit mixed up. Looks like it. I think I saw that somewhere. Or maybe we're gonna see it later. All right. That's always a good one. That's like another nail. Okay. Okay, they look like they're a little bit mixed up. So we'll, we'll put them on order afterwards. The Doom that came, that's pretty good. Okay. So a lot of these prestige format are, are in here. All right. Let's see what else is in here. A couple of runs of Daredevil, Daredevil Father, Daredevil Yellow. Uh, Electra, you know, there's one issue that has the nudity here. Number three, I don't know if it's in here. We could check it out. Uh, I'll check it out later because it's I, I'm holding the phone. Then you have a Daredevil run, not bad. This is a pretty good, a pretty good set there. Okay. Uh, yeah, someone asked me Hulk 181. Uh, we have uh, two copies. We're getting to get graded. Uh, they're gonna pre probably be in a six o seven o. Uh, they're going to be probably around like four or $5,000. All right. So if someone asked me that question, uh, Pino. Uh, all right. Let me see. So you have more Daredevils. I know that he pulled out some issues in here for whatever reason. He said he didn't buy them, but I believe he sold them. Uh, and that's why like number nine and 10, you know, first Echo. And number one, 11, first the Lady uh, Bullseye, which is a good one. And then you have another set of Redemption. Okay. So it's not that bad here. Okay, let's look at here. What else is in here? So most of the books are in nice shape. The, the older ones are really not that great. Uh, you know, this is always a good one. This is a uh, first Damien. That's a good one too. Yeah, the son of, uh, of Batman. Uh, this is another good one. 
uh, first appearance of uh, Gotham City Sirens. Uh, and Unit is number one, you know, not in the best shape in the world, so it's not worth much. X Force number one, they printed a zillion copies. A uh, second appearance of Deadpool, nothing really big. Uh, this is pretty nice. That's a, uh, but I think the condition, the condition could be nice. That's a, uh, basically first Domino, the real first appearance. Okay, some Green Lantern ones, a She Hulk number one, not bad. It looks like a nice copy. Okay, Wonder Woman one, it was good. Guardians of the Galaxy one. Uh, Alpha Flight number one. So all like number ones there. Those are all like nice number ones. Prime, Generation, Alpha, Justice. Okay. Uh, Catwoman number one. Cage one. Captain America one. Now this guy likes number ones. A lot of number ones. Okay. There's nothing really expensive here. Galactus. Uh, I don't know why he just collected ones. Uh, I guess he liked number ones. <laughs> That's it. So this is basically all number ones. This is this was a set. Uh, you know, some of the, you know, like Amalgam, that's really good there usually. Okay, nothing really out of the ordinary here. This is always good. Spider-Man. Black Knight, that's a, that's, can you believe this sells? Yeah, it sells, yeah. And it's a, it's a new stand edition. I don't know if it's a nice shape. If it's a nice shape, you could probably get this book graded. So we're probably going to get that book graded just because it's a new stand edition. And here's another Avengers number one. So we'll sell Suicide Squad. Batman the Outsider. Batman Mad Monk. Okay. Looking good. Looking good. You know, not bad. I mean, it's nothing. It's okay. I mean, nothing. Oh, this is always good. The Dark Avengers one. First appearance of the new team. That's a good book. Okay. I like that one. So we're going to get some of these books graded. They look like pretty nice shape. They look nice enough to be graded. The last issue, Daredevil 380, that's always a good one. Always sells for good money. You have a run of um, uh, The Man Without Fear went to five, so that's always good. Yeah. All right, so Phoenix number one. And untold Story. So this is, uh, it was never told, so basically... Um, you know, it's pretty good there by Burn. That's a good storyline. House of uh, M. It looks like a complete run. Spider-Man, Gatebreaker. It looks like some of the prestige format. Like I told you earlier, some of the Elseworld comics are in here. Uh, these always sell very, very well. Uh, you know, they, they're they prestige format, so they're pretty good. Uh, the New Frontier, that's a pretty good run. Let me see if it's complete. Yeah, it looks like it's complete, so we could put that aside. That's a good one. You know, if you haven't read it, it's pretty good. Uh, yeah, so uh, the Darwin Cook and, uh, you know, uh, you can't go wrong with Darwin Cook, unfortunately. I think he, yeah, too bad what happened to him there. Uh, this is a good book, DMZ number one. They're doing TV shows, so that's going for, like, good money. I think it's, like, two three $300, that book. I think the whole run is here. So one to uh, two to sixty. So number one, we're gonna get graded, and the other rest we're gonna probably just put on one to sixty-four, and we're gonna get the rest uh, just you know listed on eBay. Uh, run nice uh, chunk of detective comics. All right, so not bad, not bad. Uh, all right, so that's it, guys. So I think I showed you everything. Uh, I don't know if you have guys any questions. If you do, don't be shy. Uh, look, uh, guys, I want to wish you. Uh, uh, I know it's not our Canadian Thanksgiving, but I wish all Americans a uh, Thanksgiving. I uh, hope you celebrate it with your family and, uh, you know, and enjoy your day and uh, love you guys. Okay? Have a good day.